Hi, Tara Boston Kimber here, founder and therapist with the Counseling Hub. So I wanted to spend some time really, really quick and talk about, hmm, I say really fast, as fast as I can, and talk about what happens if conversations don't go well. So I specialize in relationship stuff and couples and marriages and just relationship counseling in general. So even people in poly relationships, non uh, consensual, non-monogamy relationships and all that. Um, and one thing that can happen is that we spend a lot of time focusing on how we're saying things and how we are coming across and we're being really intentional with the language that we're using. And often it's received well because it's, it's done in therapy. Like people are here because they're working together. So sometimes I think a question becomes what happens if, you know, I try to have a conversation with somebody and it doesn't go well. Like they, uh, they don't receive it, they're not interested in what I have to say, um, what do I do then? And my short answer is nothing. So the shitty part of conversations is that we don't really have control over where they go or how they go. What we have control over, and this is, this is kind of a key piece, I think it's a key piece, is that, you know, we can act in integrity in terms of the way that we say things and how we language things and we can stand firm on our own beliefs and the way that we feel but we like in essence we can't change how somebody else feels or what they think or whether or not they're in a place where they can actually receive or maybe even receive well what is being said so um i think that's pretty much that 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 the focus for the way we talk about things should literally just be on you and less on how is the other person going to respond. So if we spend too much time thinking about, well, they're not going to hear me or they're not listening or they're still angry or it went really shitty, you know, my, my question I think back to you is, okay, reflect on what you did and what you could have done differently. And if you can say nothing, like I was really kind, I was really compassionate, I went out of my way to use um to use phrases and statements in such a way that i was taking full ownership and of my part of the conversation and they just really didn't seem in a place to hear it then there's your answer just because something doesn't go well doesn't mean it's all your fault um but again what can we stand firm on and as long as we can stand firm on having integrity in terms of the way that we say things i would say that's a win even if the conversation doesn't go great so that's all have a great day. I'll see you next time. Bye.